Hello loves, it's Sasha. Today I'm going to be doing a eye makeup tutorial using the Naked, the first Naked palette. So this is basically for beginners, so you know how to do, you know, a smoky, simple kind of eye look. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I also did my brows, and I showed you how to do it. I didn't put any foundation because I'm just focusing on the eye. That's the main part of the video, so I hope you enjoy, and let's get started. I'm now going in with the color Virgin and using that as a base for my whole eye. You're going to want to take an eyeshadow that is about a shade or two darker than your own skin tone and run it back and forth onto your crease. I'm using the shade Naked from the Naked palette and this will be your transition shade. Next I'm going to be putting that color, the darker color, in the outer crease and if you're wondering what a crease is, it's the space between where your eyelids fold and where your brow bone begins. Use a fluffy brush to sweep the eyeshadow back and forth onto the crease. This is a method that a lot of people call the windshield wiper method because the motion is reminiscent to how a windshield wiper works. Now you don't have to do this but I'm just going to be spicing it up a little bit and be putting that like pinky color in the inner crease. I'm making it a little more shimmery and I'm going to be taking that color which is dark horse and be putting it in the outer V and I'm just going to be slowly merging it into the inner like into the actual crease. If you don't know where your outer V is just place a brush near the end of your lash line and sweep to the side to the left for your right eye and to the right for your left eye. Take the brush back to the end of the lash line and go slightly up into your crease. Now I'm going to be putting that color naked onto the lower lash line and this is optional but I want it to look decent so that was the first color I used. And then I'm going to be taking sidecar and putting that as like a shimmery color onto all those darker colors in the crease. Now I'm going to be taking sin and be putting that as a lid color i to pat it onto your lid so no excess eyeshadow falls on your face so it doesn't look like a shimmery mess. Now I'm going to be taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in medium brown and be filling in my eyebrows because your eyebrows shape the face. Here are a few tips. Now I suggest placing a brush alongside of your nose to find where your brow should ideally start. You're going to want to angle the brush from the outside of your nose to the outer corner of your eye to find where your brow should ideally end. The end of the brow's point should be at a 45 degree angle from the outside end of the eye. So brush brows up with a spoolie brush. This helps you to see the shape you like and to see where they are uneven. So you also want to use short dash like strokes to mimic your natural hair. Softly fill in any sparse areas with the pencil. Choose the color that best matches your brows. Fill in really lightly so it's barely there. Now you're going to use an angled brush and a similarly colored pressed powder to define the shape of your brows even more. The goal is to have the most even eyebrows, but try not to overly fill the inside corners of the brows or the end points too harsh. Then you're going to brush through the brows again with the spoolie to blend out the color and soften any harsh lines. To set the look, you will maybe want to comb through it with the color gel, but that's optional. I'm now going to be doing my winged eyeliner with the NYX The Curve Eyeliner and you want to go a tiny bit where like the um, smoky eye look ends. You're going to just make a little line and then connect it from your lids to that line and go as close as you can to your lash line but not directly onto your lashes.
hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also comment down below what you guys want to see next. And that's it for this video. I will talk to you guys next time. Bye princesses.